Hello, everybody. My name is Ian Lamont. I am the author of Lean Media, available from leanmedia.org, and I also talk about Amazon quite a bit. Today, I'm going to be talking about an Amazon seller program. It's a promotional program that lets you create a you know buy two, get one free type of promotion. This is how to do it. So I'm assuming, first of all, that you have Amazon Seller Central and the pro version of Amazon Seller. So you have to pay extra every month to get that because that unlocks all of these special marketing programs you can use. So here's my Amazon Seller inventory. Go to Advertising Promotions. And by the way, the interface may change a little bit depending on how um, when you're watching this video or some of the things that you're able to use. Okay, go to the Promotions screen. And you ha you'll see all these options here. Um, it's important to note this is a create a promotion area. You can also manage existing promotions and manage product selection. And before you get started on creating any of these promotions that are on this page, you need to have uh, products that you've selected to be in the promotions. Amazon doesn't automatically make them available. You have to kind of set it up so they're available. And I've done that already, and I created another video that shows how to do it. But here are some of the product selections that I've created based on the brands that I own. Okay, so we're gonna do a buy one, get one type of promotion. So again, advertising promotions, oops, advertising promotions. You'll come to the screen, click on create below buy one, get one. This screen looks a little confusing and actually it is. I think Amazon, is hopefully going to improve the interface for some of these tools because they're a little bit kind of engineering like and a little bit techy. Um, I'll show you how to use it. This is the current iteration of it. This is uh, 2019. I imagine Amazon will make it easier to use so people start using this more often. And uh, basically this is how you get started. So this is buy one get one. So it starts with the conditions. So the buyer purchases at least this quantity of items. You can also set it up so it's a dollar amount. So maybe like um, if you spend at least $30, you'll get $5 worth of products free or something like that. I'm going to do at least this quantity of items. So let's say you buy um, three items, purchased item. This is the item that you want to make available, that you want to have trigger the promotion. So I want them to buy three of something. So actually, I have a couple products right here. Um, these are easy to understand. Pedigree chart or fan chart. Actually, let's let's select another one. I have a, I have a lot of I have a lot of items here. Uh, okay, so let's say that people buy the Easy Genie Pink product. This is a well. This is a product that sells pretty well. People seem to like it. Ten blank pedigree charts. It's a bundle. Pink packaging. Click OK. Okay. So people buy three of this. Buyer gets free items. That sounds good, doesn't it? Okay, there's nothing else to choose there. Applies to purchased items. Buyer benefit applies to a quantity of one when buyer purchases three of the pink ones. Okay, so basically, if you buy three, you'll get one free. And actually, that's a little bit too generous because I know my I know my cost structure. I won't be making much money on that one. Um, I ha it has to be a little bit of a balance where you're giving this the customer some benefit, but also your business too. So I'm going to change that to buy four, get one free. Okay. Um, start date. You know, sometimes when I have a campaign, it, it shows the Chinese version of this. I don't know why that is. So I am going to select, um, I can actually read Chinese. This says 2019 March. So I'm going to select uh, uh, one. And I'm going to have it end on the end of March, the 31st. And I can see they messed up, they, they reversed the, um, the dates in Chinese. I don't know why this is so this is like kind of a buggy thing, but I have to deal with it. Anyways, internal description buy four pink packets, get one free. Okay. And this is the code automatically generated. I'm actually going to use a an inter, I'm going to use the text I used up I have up 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 here so I remember what it is. Buy four pink packets, get one free, March 2019. Okay. 
so claim code. I definitely don't want people to abuse this, so I'm going to say single use. One redemption per customer. Um, customized messaging. Okay, check out display text, promotion applied. So you can change this text to something else. It can be no more than 19 characters long. Sometimes I like to say discount applied so people is clear that it is a discount. Um, but here I'm just going to say, all right, buy for get one promotion, promo apply. Okay, hopefully people will understand that. Detail page display text. This is so critical. I don't know why Amazon doesn't check that off by default. Basically, if you don't fill this field in, people won't even see the promotion. Here's what the promotion looks like. Uh, here's, on, here's one of my other products where I have a promotion running. The promotion will appear underneath the product information, special offers and product promotions. So here's one of these, a similar, a similar um, promotion that I created for another product. So it shows up here below the, the uh, product information. I'd actually like it if it showed up higher on the page, but anyways, it does show up on the page. As long as you have page detail, uh, sorry, the, uh, de the detail page text. And why isn't it let me do that? Oh, maybe it, maybe it restricts it because um, I've already set it up to I've already set it up here. In other ways, it'll just show it automatically. But in any case, um, if you if you can try to actually let's do this. I think I can do it this way. Yeah, here we go. Okay. I'm just going to copy the text that I have here for the internal description and just put it as the customized text that will show up by four easy genie uh, pedigree chart packets get one free. Okay, I think that's pretty clear that it ac accurately, accurately reflects what it's all about. Display precedence. This basically controls where the promotion will be will be displayed if you have more than one promotion going on at the same time. So it's 50 is in the middle. If you want it to, if you want the promotion to appear higher, you would select one or two or three or something like that. Lower, you'd put it, you know, you know, 99 or 100. Terms and conditions. Fortunately, Amazon gives you terms and conditions, so you don't have to think about that. But you may want to customize that depending on how you're setting it up. You, can, you have to review your promotion. So you, you can see that already there are some problems here. Um, it flagged it for me. One is the date. This is this Chinese thing. All right, now it's showing the English version of the, of the calendar. So let me just change that. All right. Uh, checkout display text. Promotion checkout text is too long. Please enter ch checkout text up to 19 characters long. All right, buy four, get one promo. I'm just going to do that. Qualifying items. Here's the custom text. That's really important. Here's the terms and condition review. Okay. This has all this information and hit submit. Now it's important to note if you've submit, if you've created a promotion, you need to edit it. Just come to this page, uh, advertising promotions, click manage your promotions, and then you can do things like edit it. So right here, I can edit a promotion if I want to edit this one. I don't know where the other ones are. I have to look around. Oh, I see, because it's pending. Yeah, so here's here's some of the promotion I've just created. If I wanted to edit that one, I just go to Actions, Edit, and I could make some changes. To learn how to get more out of Amazon and other types of online publishing and online selling types of programs, go to leanmedia.org. I have a book about creating media, and I also have a blog that talks about all kinds of programs and strategies and tactics you can use. And finally, if you go to leanmedia.org slash video, I have this YouTube channel which has dozens of videos about Amazon selling, Amazon advertising, Amazon Advantage, Amazon Transparency, all of these uh, programs that you may or may not know about. And uh, I explain them there and it's all free. Thank you so much for watching and hope to see you soon.